Hey guys, and welcome to Zarya's third tech episode. Let's do it. Number one, cancel your secondary fire into your ult. Zarya's ultimate interrupts everything in Zarya's kit, but the most useful of these interrupts by far is this cancel. It is a small efficiency trick that will have the first shot of your ult fire hit before the duration of the ult starts, and is a simple way to increase your burst damage during the ult due to it. Number 2. Save people from Reinhardt's charge with Barrier. This one seems very obvious, but newcomers to this character will very often let this happen. This transforms the outcome from Reinhardt often killing your teammate and gaining that ult charge to saving the ally, him gaining no ult charge and you instantly getting maximum charge from the shield. It is really the optimal time to use the projected Barrier. Number 3. Use Barrier at any time you suspect a Sombra is about to EMP. Zarya's barriers are a hard counter to it in that they preserve her shields from being shaved off, prevent the silence, and give her charge, as EMP does not delete the shield, but deals full damage to it. This also works for her projected barrier, which will double to prevent an ally from being silenced and give you charge. Number 4. Fire alternate fires from spawn towards the battlefield. Let's be honest guys, losing the accuracy for all the shots you're missing doesn't actually mean anything. This is still the optimal way to approach the battlefield because, unless we've all forgotten, we have unlimited ammo and occasionally one of these shots will hit, which at the very least will charge your ultimate, but could score a kill or make the difference in one of your allies' duels. Number 5. Use your shield to bait out and block most forms of crowd control. This is useful against characters that will absolutely use their crowd control skill in the scenario that you're in. For example, if you're close to McCree, you can bet he's going to throw a flashbang, so be prepared to barrier. If you're facing off against a Roadhog in mid-range, you can bet he's going to hook, so do the same. This is very swingy in engagements where opponents rely on this type of CC to win the matchup. Thanks for watching.